Improving the quality of point cloud data. The process of improving point cloud data falls under two general categories, editing and filtering. Editing involves updating the characteristics of individual or groups of points, while filtering infers the removal of points that are not needed. After loading a point cloud into Global Mapper, a good first step is to take a look at the metadata. The metadata reveals a wide variety of information about the layer, including elevation range, average density, point spacing, coverage area, and current classification of points. The most common editing procedure applied to point cloud data is applying or updating classification values to reflect the type of surface represented. Points can be selected in 2D view, 3D view, or the path profile cross-section view to be manually classified. A more efficient alternative to manual classification is to use one of the LiDAR module's automatic classification tools. These specialized algorithms with some user input parameters geometrically analyze the point cloud to identify and classify specific types of points. Rectifying a point cloud to correct any positional errors in the data can be done manually or with an automatic tool using a reference point cloud or ground control points. Filtering a point cloud to remove unneeded data points can be done geographically or by any point return characteristics present in the data. The filtering point cloud tool can be used to remove entire classes of points from view. This setting will be maintained as you move from editing and filtering the point cloud to analysis. To learn more about improving your point cloud data in Global Mapper, read the blog on this topic available at bluemarblegeo.com. If you're considering Global Mapper, download a free trial today.